did. Um, and then, you know, to let them out of a three by three cage and bring them into a big room, I mean, their, their first inclination is going to be to explore a little bit. So, and I always tell people, you know, you get a, you get a kitten, um, we, we have, well, we have a behavioral program that we do here that we do on cats and we won't test them until they're nine months old because yeah. there's just no point. Their, their behavior changes so radically from two months to nine months that testing kittens is just, you know, because that, 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 that behavioral evaluation will actually tell us is the cat going to be a lap cat, is it going to be outgoing, all those types of things. So you don't know. <laughs> exactly, we don't know. So at this point, these guys could both, you know, become very outgoing and, and affectionate, or they can sort of continue being oh. like this. I think he needs glasses. <laughs> you need glasses? Yeah, so they're all fixed. Are they chipped too? Yes. Yes, they are. Good. And what shots would they need when they left, when they leave here? Um, these guys probably aren't going to need anything except for rabies. They do need. They will need a second FVRC, or sorry, a third FVRCP vaccination on the ninth, and then they'll need their rabies when they turn four months. But you will get a voucher to bring them back here and have that done for free. Oh, cool. Can't yeah, with Pet Extreme and, and Woodland is really good too. A very reasonable vaccination there. I'm yeah. So impressed by that. It costs fifteen dollars to do it here. The, the FVRCP vaccination. Oh, I think that's basically our yeah. cost. And then the rabies vaccination is free. For the first one, and after that, they're six dollars. That's really, really, really reasonable. Huh? Can't get better than free either, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, they're so cute. And that, so, how many were in the litter? Do you know? I don't know. It may have just been these two. So skinny. We get so many kids this time of year, that's impossible. <laughs> so they don't have worms or anything? Right? They have been deworm. Because they're really thin, but maybe because they're just so active. Well, they're, they're pretty normal. Come around, we'll let you in. They come in this way. Oh, oh, no, they can go around. No. <laughs> Don't let them out. <laughs> we're looking all over you guys. Oh, I know, I know. Right I'm here. I was wondering where, where they said they were looking at the dog, though. Leave me, guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, their mother was Pharaoh, he says. This is Gideon, by the way. <laughs> you don't think so? You don't think they're coming out? There's another one. Oh my gosh, well, he so says sorry. it's not unusual for them to act because they're. What about the ones that. Well, we can look at those too. Yeah, you can look at as many as you want. That's like I said, though. I mean, you take a cat out of a 3x3 three three enclosure and you bring it in here, people are not going to be the thing that it's most interested in. 99% of the time. They want to smell where the other cats have been. They finally have something they can claw. There's new toys. There's a billion smells. So cats aren't like dogs. You know, they don't build that immediate bond with people like dogs do. And so um, in many cases, this is, you know, kittens are just, they have very short attention spans and all they want to do is explore. And well, we're used to so. short attention spans. Yeah. yeah I, understand. <laughs> I have, have four-year-old twin son. There's one I want to that black one. Okay. We can oh, those. So. Yeah, yeah, they were kind of cute. So are these no. male or female? I don't even know. Uh, I, think, I think that Where you think one, one is male, the other is female. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah, well, that was definitely female because that's a Torby. Oh. Oh. So they're all She's female. She's really pretty. All the tricolor cats are female like 99.9% .9 of the time. I've seen one male Torby calico in the 15 years that I've been working. Yeah, I've never seen one. I had a lot of calicos they're, over the years. They're almost they're great. always male so or female. And yeah, male and female, that's good. And they're from the same litter, so that would be they get along good together. Mm -hmm. And we could look at the others too, but yeah, I sure. really am interested in these two. 